Hi, my name is Yasmin Spendla and I'm a quantum physicist at the Center for Engineered Quantum Systems. I'm developing a computer that works with light and vibrations instead of electrons. Data transfer is so deeply interwoven in our daily lives that it's like the air we breathe. We only notice it when there's a problem. But the past year, people everywhere in the world have realized how much we depend on it to even connect to each other. Last year, in our lab in Queensland, we did a world's first demonstration where we converted information in the form of light to information in the form of a vibration of a liquid and then back into light, and all of them on a silicon chip. This year, we showed that those vibrations of the liquid can actually be used instead of electrons as a building block, not just of normal computers, but also of quantum computers, thereby bridging the gap between the two. The development of this new generation of quantum computers that work fundamentally differently from the computers that are in broad use today are a condition for progress in every single branch of society today, from medicine to national security. As a woman from a multicultural family, I've lived the experience that science really can bring everyone together. I was the only woman in most of my undergrad. And I hear there's more women now, but there's still a lot of work to do. I've had countless opportunities to speak with leaders in industry, politics, and especially with young people. At Equus, I'm chairing the Quantum for Educators team where we try and support high school science teachers because they are the ones that introduce our kids into this new world. So if you see this and you think, I might want to do that, please come join us. There's so much work to do and the world is counting on us.